Welcome to the Old Wood Truck, where today we're going to talk about how to build the uh, cutting board butter. Uh, last video we built the cutting board, and so now we're just going to show you how to protect it and draw out the grain a little bit. First step is to just kind of shave that straight beeswax, uh, and just shave that stuff down. It's pretty tough stuff, um, so what I just did was disappear to go run the knife under some hot water, and just heat it up a little bit, and that seems to help get through, uh, but it's still pretty pretty robust stuff this really isn't a terribly necessary step it just speeds up the process a lot when it goes to dissolve um, so what we're going to do is dissolve this in some mineral oil um, and if it's just one big block it takes a long long time so this is just shaving it down um, and and then we'll add it into the oil little by little so now we'll set the oil on about medium heat, a little bit medium low. Um, and I'm putting in just one container of mineral oil there and just letting it preheat a little bit. Uh, then we'll add our beeswax just bit by bit and let it slowly dissolve. And we just stir it in. Um, here's adding a little bit more. And you can see it's not a very fast process, but ultimately it takes maybe 10 minutes total uh, but you just don't want to add it all at once just add it a little bit at a time and give it a minute to dissolve and then you can add some more just like cooking um, and just keep stirring it you might get a little smoke off the uh, thing if you spill any oil over the edges which I did and so you can see the smoke right there and then in that case I just took it off the burner and moved it to another burner uh, if you're careful, you shouldn't get that, but <laughs> it is a potential hazard. Um, so now all the beeswax is in, and we're just going to let this dissolve slowly. And so there it started to dissolve. You can see I've got it off that burner, and um, just letting the, the last little bits dissolve. And we got it all clear. And that's what it look, this slightly yellowish tinge, um, but it should be pretty liquidy at this stage. So now I pour it into these little gift jars. Uh, I have a big jar that I keep for myself, but um, this is about what I'll give out with the cutting board. Not to last somebody months. I mean, this this stuff goes a long way. Um, so if I'm giving away a cutting board, I try to give away a little jar of stuff as well. Uh, and then I pour the rest of that into my big jar, which you can see here. This is an example of how to put it on. I tell people that aren't familiar with it, it's just basically like greasing a baking sheet. Um, it's got the consistency of very soft butter and you just apply it and wipe it on just like you would a uh, baking sheet and I do the front and back you can see how it kind of draws out the grain there and makes it look nice uh, and also gives a nice protective and smooth finish so that's that's building the butter um, and you'll see here the last couple of images just the board as it's completed and how well that draws out the grain and uh, how much you can really see what, what an improvement it looks like with that stuff on there. So thanks for watching, like, subscribe, appreciate it.